Ginny Cube, how to play. The object of the game is to score the most points. Each set of tiles represents a full deck of cards plus two jokers. For three or four players, use both sets of tiles. For two players, use only one set. Lay out the board. Place all the tiles face down in the lid of the box and mix them up. Each player draws seven tiles and places them on their rack. Pick a player to go first, then play proceeds clockwise. On your turn, draw one tile from the box and add it to your rack. If you cannot play, then return one or more of your tiles face down to the box, then mix them up, then draw until you have seven. Your turn is now over and the next player goes. If you can make a play to the board, then you may play down the tiles. You are allowed to play melds and runs. A meld is three or four tiles of the same number but in different suits. A run is three or more tiles of the same suit but in ascending or descending order. Aces may be played either high or low. Jokers are wilds and may represent any card in the deck. Once played, the card they represent may not be changed. The first play of the game must be played to the center red start square. Once the first play is made, all subsequent plays must be made in crossword fashion by incorporating at least one tile of an existing meld or run into your play. Plays may be made horizontally or vertically, but not diagonally. You can add to an existing meld or run started by any player, form a new meld or run, or open a new sequence on a red start square. You may make as many plays as you want in any single section in a turn, but you may not make plays to multiple sections in a single turn. Sections may not cover other red start spaces, nor may sections join together. After you play down tiles, you draw tiles to your rack until you get back up to seven, and then you score points. To score points, each tile, two through nine, is worth its face value. 10, jack, queen, and king are each worth 10 points. Ace is worth one point when used in a run and 15 points when used in a meld. Jokers are worth zero points. Add up all the tiles in the entire meld or run, not just the tiles you placed, and record your score on a paper. If you covered a bonus square, apply the bonus. Yellow doubles the value of any single tile on it, while green triples it. Red doubles the value of a meld or run, and blue triples it. Adding tiles to an existing meld or run does not grant a red or blue bonus. Instead, you must create a new meld or run to get that bonus. You may only score bonuses on the turn you cover the bonus square and not later when you add to one previously covered. If multiple bonuses are covered in the same turn, then they are both counted or multiplied. Once the lid runs out of tiles, players continue playing without drawing until no more plays can be made. Then points are subtracted from players' scores for their remaining tiles. Aces count as 15. Then the player with the most points wins.